Okay, so now we can um, test our login script. So if we just click on the login button, that's going to launch the login form. And if I type in my username, which I've registered, which is Mr. Gregson, and my password is Ashlawn School, but if I just put in Ashlawn and try to log in, you'll see it comes up with an incorrect password. So if I put my actual password, which I registered with Ashlawn School, and click login, it tells me my login successful and it's taken me to my input sheet, which is what we wanted it to do. The only thing at the moment which isn't too great is that when we type in our password, you can see all the characters. So we're going to need to go back into our VBA editor to um, sort that out. So if I click up here to Visual Basic and double click on my form and select the password um, text box. In the properties window down here, you'll see that there is one of the properties called password char which stands for password character. I'm just going to pop in here the star symbol and do the same for the register password box and put the star symbol in and then close down our VBA editor. Now if I click on login I can put in my username and you'll notice when I put my password in um, it uses the stars instead so a lot more secure. Um, the only thing we issue that is still left with this, which I've managed to resolve as of yet, is that if you put in um, a username, which hasn't been currently registered, if I register registered correctly, and just putting in any old password, it doesn't do anything at the moment. So you need to, if anybody knows any um, code that I can edit to make that work in, so it comes up with an error there. That'd be brilliant, but you have got a fully functioning register and login um, box in your Excel worksheet.